Hello, in this video we're going to look at how to calculate gross domestic product. So first uh, we have an economy with two goods. This economy produces guitars and drums. We have the price of guitars uh, for three years and the number of guitars produced in those years and likewise we have the same information for drums. We are told that the base year is 2015 and given this information we want to calculate nominal GDP Nominal GDP is just GDP measured in the prices of the current year. So you take the output of that year, so for example the output in 2015 for guitars and drums, and you would multiply that by their respective prices, and then sum those two values together. Real GDP is GDP measured in the prices of the base year. We're told that the base year is 2015, so every time we calculate real GDP, we're going to be multiplying a particular year's output by base year prices. In this case, we're going to use $500 for the price of guitars and $1,000 for the price of drums. So I show the calculations down here. Let me first go through nominal GDP. In 2015, nominal GDP is going to be the price of guitars multiplied by the number of guitars produced. So we get the total expenditures on guitars. And then we're going to add to that the total expenditures on drums. The total expenditures on drums are 1,000 times 25. So nominal GDP in 2015 is $75,000. In 2016, we do a similar thing. We take the prices in 2016 and multiply it by the outputs of guitars and drums in 2016. So $520 times 110 guitars produced, plus 1,050 times 30, uh, 30 drums produced. That gives us 88,700 for nominal GDP in 2016. And likewise, I do a similar thing here for 2017. Just the prices in 2017 multiplied by the outputs of those goods in 2017. Moving on to the last column, real GDP, we're going to take the base year price and multiply that by the output in the year that we're looking at to calculate real GDP. So in 2015, the base year price for guitars is $500. By default, that is the base year by definition in this example. So we already did this calculation over here. And it should be no surprise that real GDP and nominal GDP will be the same in the base year. That will always be the case. In 2016, we're still using the price of guitars in 2015 and the price of drums in 2015 to multiply it by the output in 2016. So 500 times 110 plus 1,000 times 30 that gives us real GDP in 2016. What we're trying to do is we're trying to hold prices constant to see what's happening to output. Are we actually producing more? And as you can see here, real GDP increased. So this economy has experienced some economic growth. We look at real GDP to determine economic growth. And then finally in 2017, we take the output in 2017 and multiply it by the base year price, which happens to be 2015 prices, so 500 times 112, and then we're going to add to that the price of drums times uh, quantity of drums, where the price of drums is the 2015 price once again. And we do that, and we see here, again, real GDP is slightly higher at 88000 So once again, the economy has experienced some growth uh, from 2016 into 2017. Okay, I hope you found this video helpful.